Yeah, Yao was very unique. You know, he was 7'6", so he was way up there. And his skill set was incredible because most big guys can't shoot like him. And he had soft touch and he had nice moves like Akeem Olajuwon, fall away jump shots. He was a, a matchup nightmare. You knew you weren't going to stop him because you can't block a shot. And he had terrific touch. Um, I think he brought a whole country to watch the NBA when he got to the NBA. China was a, a huge affluence in that, in that regard. And then it was a challenge. He brought the best out of you because you know if you didn't bring your A game, you know, he was going to embarrass you. He was that good. So um, for me, I, I really enjoyed competing against the Houston Rockets and Yao Ming and Tracy McGrady. They had a very great team. And you know, once upon a time, we got them in game seven, and somehow we won. <laughs> so it was pretty cool. Yeah, I think it would be great if they can get a guy. You know, I, I got a chance to play with Yi, and he was terrific too. Not as good as Yao. Yao's, he's like one in, one in a lifetime kind of guy, right? But they love basketball there, and I know they train hard. They, they follow the NBA. There will be somebody, again, from China who will have an impact and make it to the NBA. You know, I went to Hong Kong and uh, spent some great time in Shanghai. There's a place in Shanghai called Mr. and Mrs. Bun. Cr incredible food if you, I like food, incredible food. Um, I got a chance to enjoy a different culture, you know, see how they grow up over there, different religions and get educated about their lifestyles. And it's very interesting when you travel and you get to experience somebody else's culture. So I really enjoy my time in China. Some of the best players we have in the world are from other countries. And I could easily see games being played in China and, and other places overseas. NBA fans out there in China, hi, this is Carlos Boozer. Had a great time coming to, to China, playing over there. Keep watching the NBA. We love your support. Keep tuning in. More to come.